What is up guys, welcome back to another video on the channel. So in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make a YouTube logo for free using Pixlr Editor. So if you guys do find this video helpful, make sure to drop a like. And with that being said, let's get right into the video. All right guys, so the first thing you wanna do is go to pixlr.com. I'm gonna leave the link in the description. So once you're on this page, go ahead and click create a new image. And for the width and height, go ahead and enter 800 by 800. And make sure that transparent is checked. And go ahead and click okay. So the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and add a background image. So I'm gonna add a space background. So just go to Google, type in space background and choose any image you guys would like. So I already chose an image for myself. So in order to open up an image, go to file, open image, and go ahead and open up the image that you chose. Now the next thing you want to do is go ahead and click control A to select the image, control C to copy, and uh, go ahead and close this image, and control V to paste. So now we're going to go ahead and resize our image. So in order to do that, go to edit retransform and you should get these little squares around your image so just go ahead and resize now the next thing we're going to do we're going to go ahead and add our text so go to the text tool and make sure that the size is 130 and for the color change it to white and for the font we're going to be using raider crusader so if you guys don't know how to get free fonts, I do have a video on how to do that. So make sure to check that out. I'm going to leave the link in the description. So once you have chosen your font, go ahead and enter the first letter of your channel name. So I'm going to just enter the letter Z, space, and go ahead and click OK. So as you guys can see, our logo is way too small for our image. So what you want to do is go ahead and uh, go to your text layer, right click, rasterize layer, and go to edit, free transform. And you should get these little squares around your logo. Now what you want to do is go ahead and hold shift and just uh, resize it. So I think that's a good size right there. So go ahead and click enter. Now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to add a uh, texture to our logo. So go to Google, type in polygon texture and choose any of these images you guys would like. So I already chose an image for myself. So I'm going to go ahead and open it up. So file, open image and open up the image that you chose so uh, we're going to do the same thing right here control a to select the image control c to copy and go ahead and close this image and control v to paste so now we're going to go ahead and resize this image so go to edit free transform and go ahead and make it smaller just make sure that you all cover up your logo And that's good right there. So now I'll go ahead and click enter. Now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to click on the magic wand tool. Make sure that your text layer is selected. And with your magic wand tool, click right here in the middle. And you should get the outline of your uh, logo, as you guys can see. So now what you want to do is go back to the polygon texture layer. And now what you want to do is go ahead and click add layer mask, which is down here. And go ahead and click it and you should get something like this so now you could go ahead and delete your layer text so now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to add an outline to our logo so go ahead and right click layer styles and go ahead and select outer glow and for the hardness bring it all the way up to 10 for the size we're going to enter 15 and we're going to change the color to white and go ahead and click ok and ok uh, next thing we're going to do is we're going to add a circle to our logo so what you want to do is go ahead and add a new layer and go to the drawing tool and i'll make sure that the eclipse tool is selected and for border size go ahead and enter 30 and make sure that this is unchecked and we're going to change the color to white so down here and change it to white click ok so now we're going to draw our circle so from up here Bring it all the way down and that should be good right there so uh, now we're gonna center our logo so select your logo and just move it that's good right there so once you're done with your logo in order to save your image go to file save and make sure that the quality is up to 100 and then for the format select PNG Click OK and just name it whatever you guys want and go ahead and click save. 
and yeah guys that's how you make a youtube logo for free hopefully you guys did find this video helpful if you guys did make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel thanks for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one